Hello again. I'm Jeremy. This is Courtney. We're the North Sound Realty Group, and you are going to be watching our most recent market report for Snohomish County. Um, today we're covering actually the March 2022 numbers, and we're doing a little uh, little comparison to what happened last year in March as well, so you can see kind of the massive amount of growth we've had in this market. We are in the midst of some changes, and I'll talk about those kind of towards the end, but Courtney, why don't you get us started with some numbers? Okay. Yeah, huge growth this month. So Snohomish County stats are in, and this is actually our highest increase pricing for the three counties we cover. The average price for residential resale went up by 34% over last year. So it now sits at 914,280, which is crazy. There were 1,507 new listings on the market, which increased by 210 homes since last March. So homes increased by 49%. All of the homes sold increased by 49%. So this is because uh, demand overflow from King County as well as population growth. So Jeremy, what do you think about this? Well, you know, my take on it, kind of like what you just said, is that we do have a net growth um, coming into our market pretty much of about 20,000 people per year, right? So conservatively, you could say about a third of those are gonna take up housing and we just don't have the housing. We haven't had the housing. We still don't have the housing. Even though there's more new construction going on, it's not enough to basically meet that demand. And you know, even though the rates are going up, we're still seeing these massive increases in, in pricing. People are basically leaving King County, moving north, trying to find affordable housing. Snohomish County has been that because compared to King County, it's relatively affordable in a lot of ways. And we'll cover King County in another market report video. The lot sizes are bigger the lot too. sizes can be bigger, yeah. Um, <clears throat> you know, and basically with new, um, new opportunities for commuting coming up as we have light rail moving into the, the area and becoming operational, uh, we're seeing these outer counties around Seattle grow um, in value. Mm -hmm. So um, Snohomish County used to be kind of a bargain it's fast losing that status. Uh, now Pierce County is kind of becoming more of the bargain and catching up quickly. Mm -hmm. I don't necessarily see um, this changing. I think we're gonna have demand, uh, we're gonna have an excess of demand for quite a long time. If we do see an uh, um, evening out, basically like I've been saying in most of these videos, it's gonna be because of rates going up. And if the rates go up, you know, then your housing cost per month is significantly higher. So if you're holding off because you're waiting for a more sane market to buy in, mm -hmm. it's going to cost you a premium to do so, in and my opinion. We've actually seen the rates go up slightly mm -hmm. and the price has still increased since last month. So yep. what we thought was that, you know, prices would slow down with the rates increasing, but that yeah. doesn't seem to be happening. No, one of the... The desirability stays the same. Yeah, no, one of our listings that closed last last month, I mean, it went 26% um, over asking uh, and, you know, sold in three days. So That was in Linwood? Yeah, that was Linwood. Yeah. yeah. Linwood's kind of hot right now because of the light rail coming up. And, you know, it, it was North Seattle where Northgate's at. That went crazy first. And then Shoreline went crazy. And then Mount Lake Terrace went crazy. And now it's Linwood going crazy. Mm -hmm. And, you know, all these cities are putting into pro plans of, you know, potential changes to zoning to accommodate density. And so you've got not only people coming in to buy houses, but developers coming in ahead of them trying to find land to basically uh, infill. And that's our main source of new construction is infill. And yeah. with Snohomish County having lot, large lots in some instances, we're seeing those developers now discovering it mm -hmm. and creating more inventory, which we need. But still, like I said, not enough. Yeah. All right. So if you want or, or have any questions, you know, feel free to reach out to us um, directly. Mm -hmm. uh, our contact information should be on this video and um, we're happy to work with you yeah. and help you. We'd Thank be you. very happy to help yeah. you. Thanks Thank for you so watching. much. All right, bye.